Hi, my dear little ones. Good morning. How are you all? Welcome to AVS class. In the previous class, we learned about the importance of staying healthy. Today, we are going to learn more about that. Children, to having textbook, please take page number 50, chapter 10, Healthy Habits. Here, the two rows and help Mohan reach the right objects for his healthy habits. See, here you can see children, Mohan wants to brush his teeth. So, in order to brush his teeth, what he needs? He needs paste and brush. Children, where is the brush and paste? Yes, you want. Very good. Next, he wants to take bath. So to take bath, he needs bucket, mug, and soap. Where are the children? Yes, the answer is correct. Now, he wants to cut his nail. So he is searching nail cutter. Children, can you help him? Yes, you are correct. Next, he feels sneezing. He needs hunger chief. Where is that children? Yes, your answer is correct. So, all of you did well. Congrats. We now learned that our body has many parts that work for us. We must take good care of our body and form good and healthy habits to stay fit and fine. Then next, a clean body. We should keep our body clean. It is a healthy habit. Children, do you like dirty children or any people? No, we don't like dirty persons. So we should be clean always. So in order to clean, what we should do? Take a bath daily with soap and water. After the bath, wipe yourself dry with a clean towel. Next, shampoo and oil your hair regularly and keep your skull clean. Dirty hair can get flies. Yes, children, you have to take care of your hair. Otherwise, one type of insects, that is flies, it will come to your hair. Not only in human beings, even animals also, you can see flies. <coughs> then next, brush your teeth twice daily. Teeth can get germs and start floating if not brushed properly. Always brush your teeth in a circular motion. Here children, you have to brush two times in a day. One is in the morning and other one is just before going. Otherwise, your teeth will be uh, affected by germs. Next. Keep your nails short and get them clipped regularly. Long nails can have germs underneath them. So you don't allow the nails to grow because long nails, under that you can see many dirty things. So always you have to cut and short your nails, children. Wash your hands with soap before and after meals. You must also wash your hands after going to the toilet and after coming back from play. See, it is very important, children, you have to wash your hands at least five to seven times in a day. And nowadays it is very, very important. And also you have to wash your hands after going to the toilet and also after coming from play. The next Keep your nose clean and use a handkerchief with niche. Cover your mouth when you cough or sneeze. It's also very important, children. Whenever you get cough or sneeze, you have to use a handkerchief or you have to cover your mouth. The next, always use a clean toilet and flush it after use. This will keep the toilet clean and free of germs. Also, always leave the toilet floor clean and dry after using it. 
We should not spit on the road or in any public place. Spitting can spread germs. That also very important, children. You should be careful. You should not spit on the road or any other public places. See here, discuss, discuss class is there. There are many ways in which germs can enter our body and make us sick. See, many germs can enter our body in many ways, children. So, we should be always neat and clean. Then let's go green. Always close the tap after use. What is very precious, save every drop. So, after Whenever you use tap, after the use, you have to, to close the tap. Okay, children. Remember all this. The next, a healthy body. To keep our body healthy and fit, we need to. So, in order to have a healthy body, what are things we have to do? It is given here. The first point, eat healthy food. This is very, very important, children. We have to eat healthy food, not any sweet items. Better eat vegetables or fruits, something like that. So just avoid any foods or sweet items. Okay. The next, drink at least 8 to 10 glasses of clean water every day. Sleep for at least 8 to 9 hours every day. Exercise regularly. Play some games or sports regularly. So we have to drink. Children mostly don't want to drink water, isn't it? But you have to drink at least or minimum 8 to 10 glasses of clean water. That is very, very important for our body. And also exercise. Many types of exercises are there. You can choose any one or two items. And at least half an hour, you have to do the exercises. There are many kinds of exercises that we can do to stay in good health. Some of the exercises are walking, skipping, jogging, running, yoga, swimming, and dancing. So many exercises are here. In this, any one or two, you can choose. Then take in the next page 52. Do you exercise every day? Yes or no, children? What do you do to exercise? The next good posture. The way we fall in our body while sitting or standing is known as our posture. It is important to maintain a good posture while sitting, standing, and walking. A good posture helps the bones to grow properly. It also keeps them strong. Wrong postures can often lead to bad health. See, children, another important aspect is that about a posture, how we should walk or stand or sit. It should be straight. See, it is very, very important to maintain a posture while standing or sitting or walking. So it will help the bones to grow properly. And also it keeps strong. So if we won't do in the correct position, the wrong posture can often lead to bad health. So now here some pictures are given. Now take the correct picture and cross out the wrong ones. You see here, children, see the first picture, you should stand straight and not bend your shoulders. See the friend girl is bending her shoulder. That is wrong. See the behind the girl, she is standing straight. That is correct. The next picture, two boys are walking. The first boy is walking straight and the second one is bending and walking. That is wrong. So first one is correct. The second one is wrong. Yes, very good. You also should do in that way. 
the next picture two girls are sitting and here one is sitting straight and another one is bending her shoulders that is strong we should not bend our shoulder when we sit when we sit we should sit straight we can stay away from sickness if we keep our body healthy and clean so children if you don't want to get any sickness what we should do should keep our body healthy and clean our values we should not eat uncovered stale or roadside food which is then uncovered food we should not eat always eat covered food and also eat fresh food stale means old food or uh, fresh opposite is it so that we should not eat we should eat uh, fresh food and also avoid eating roadside food because many flies will come or any germs will be there so better to avoid all that, all that types of food why do you think it is important to be healthy and fit yes it is very important to be healthy and fit then we have the next page and then let's remember we should form good habits to stay healthy and fit we must keep our body clean we must eat healthy food and drink clean water we must sleep for at least 8 to 9 hours every day we should exercise regularly and maintain a good posture we should remember all these points and then and try to do all this okay then you can have a healthy you will be a healthy habits and you can maintain a healthy and fit body okay the next keyword habit let us see what's the meaning of habit children something that we do so often that we do it almost without thinking see something we do but we never think of that that is a habit the next skull the skin that covers the top and back of the head that is skull the next flies small insects that live on the body of humans and animals so if you won't wash our hair properly this insects will come to your hair so don't allow this insects to come to your hair so what we should do we should wash our hair properly the next posture the way we hold our body by sitting or standing see that is the posture we that mean we have to stand properly we have to sit straight okay children thank you